Hey guys, welcome back to the Tennisshare channel. If your iPhone 11 is stuck on the Apple logo, I get it, it's frustrating. Especially if you've had it for years and stored so much important data. I've been there and I know that feeling, but don't worry. In this video, I'll show you four simple ways to fix it without losing anything. If this has happened to you or you found a fix that worked, let me know in the comments. Now, let's dive in. First, let's quickly understand why your iPhone might get stuck in Apple logo. It could be due to a failed update, stuck in a restart due to low storage, software glitches, or even hardware issues like a faulty CPU. Older devices are more prone to this, but even newer models like the iPhone 15 aren't immune. Now, let's talk solutions. The first method you can try is a force restart. This is the go-to fix for most system glitches, and it's really easy to do. Click the volume up button, then volume down, then press and hold the side button until the Apple logo reappears. Once you see the logo, let go of the button and your phone should return to normal. But if your iPhone is still stuck, don't worry, there are other tricks up our sleeve. You can try waiting for about 15 minutes to see if your iPhone get out of the Apple logo screen automatically. Some users have reported that simply waiting allows the system to reset itself and boot up as usual. Additionally, you can try letting your iPhone's battery drain completely. Leave it alone for several hours, and once it's dead, plug it back in and see if it boots up normally. It's not the fastest method, obviously, but if you're not in a rush and nothing else is working, it's worth a shot. If you don't want to wait, let me show you a much quicker way using Rei Boot. This will get your phone back to normal without data loss. I'll drop the link below. Just download and install Rei Boot on your computer and connect your iPhone. After this, you need to enter recovery mode on your phone. The process is similar to a force restart, but you need to hold the side button longer. Open Rei Boot and click Start Repair. Then choose Standard Repair. Then, follow the on-screen steps. It will download the firmware quickly, and after that, it will fix your phone. I've seen people in the YouTube comments say they were ready to restore their phone, but this method saved their data. If you have important photos, messages or notes, try this first before doing a full factory reset. Now your phone will back to normal. All your data are safe. Give it a try if you need it. If you're interested, you can also use the official Apple software to update your device to the latest version and see if that helps. Just download the Apple Devices app on your PC. And you need to put your phone into recovery mode too. The app should detect the status of your iPhone. Choose the Update button. If your phone is already on the latest version, it will erase your data. If you want to avoid that, you can try Rei Boot instead. If you click Update, wait for it to complete. It may get your phone out of Apple logo screen. You can also use iTunes or Finder to do this. They work pretty much the same. So, those are four ways to fix an iPhone stuck in Apple logo. If you're lucky, a simple force restart will do the trick. If not, Rei Boot can save you a ton of time and data. If this video helped, like and subscribe for more iPhone tips. And if you found a different solution that worked, please share it in the comments. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.